All right, hello everyone, and welcome to day six on board the PNO Azura, which is a sea day as we make our way so <clears throat> as we make our way down south to our last port of call of Lanzarote. As you can probably tell from the previous videos, we are experiencing a bit of rough weather, uh, which is kind of what I was expecting anyway. Uh, we were told that we're sailing for a bit of low pressure, uh, which is what's causing the rough seas, but that we're sailing out of it, which I assume means the weather's going to get better. But I'm not a qualified weatherman, so I don't know, but I assume that's probably what that means. But what I can tell you is that the rain has thankfully stopped uh, following yesterday and that the sun is currently beating down. It's boiling out there at the moment. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get lotioned up and I'm going to go enjoy the sun. And hopefully this time I won't miss it because last time I got lotioned up and I went upstairs to start sunbathing and it got all cloudy and it all finished. So hopefully today we'll be okay. Well, I think that's about as much sun as we're going to get today, um, which was nice while it lasted. Um, I find it difficult um, sunbathing because you don't want to overdo it and burn yourself, but you also want to make the most of it, um, especially because I know that in a few days I'll be back in Britain, which I can assure you it'll be a lot colder than what it is here. But yeah, I don't think I burnt, uh, which is good. Um, <laughs> I don't know how I'm managing this, but I'm doing quite well this time. Um, so what I think I'll do now is I have a shower get rid of all of the um, lotion stuff off me and then um, we'll figure out what we're going to do after that because I don't know. I, I, haven't thought this, <laughs> I haven't thought this far ahead. I don't know. We'll probably, <laughs> we'll think about it later. We'll, we'll decide it later. Don't worry. All right, just on another note, my clothes from yesterday are still absolutely soaked. Um, <laughs> so I don't know. I might have to take these home wet, um, which might put me over the baggage allowance because they are very heavy <laughs> with all that water in them. <sighs> Nothing like a good old shower to make you feel better. I did manage to get shampoo in my eye though, like some sort of child. Um, but apart from that, it was pretty good. And I'm definitely not burnt, uh, which I'm really surprised about actually. We're not getting a lot of luck with these sunsets, are we? Those <laughs> damn clouds always getting in the way. But there you go. Um, I was going to go eat some food in the buffet as well, uh, but it's shut at the moment because uh, it shuts from five to six whilst they change over from dinner to tea service. Um, so we're going to have to wait a bit for that. But that's, that shouldn't be an issue. I'm sure I can manage that. Um, tonight is formal night um, or black tie night, as p and like to call it. So I'd better put a black tie on, I guess. So... Um, Bear with me a second. How do I look? <laughs> All right, so the plan for this evening, first things first, is to go get some food because I'm starving. And then after that, I'm running that route. And then after that, we'll walk around and see what's going on around the Azura. Let's go.
All right, well, that's pretty much going to do it for formal night. Uh, so dancing in the atrium and elf playing on top deck. That's pretty much uh, what was going on. Of course, I did do my shopping as well. Um, so a little notes to piano. Um, if you want to get me to spend money, keep doing formal nights. Because every time we do a formal night, I end up going shopping. So there you go. But when I arrived back at my cabin, I found that my horizon for tomorrow had been delivered. And with that is some disembarkation information. So I think we're getting near the end of the cruise. Um, now, the problem I had was that my flight home is at 3.45. So I assumed that they were going to kick us off the ship early and I'd be sat in the airport for like six hours. But that's actually not the case. If you have a look at this, uh, so London Gatwick is where I'm flying back to. The meeting time is 12.15. So that means that I'm going to be on the ship until about half 12, which is quite strange, really, when you think about it. But I'm not going to complain. Um, obviously, we have to leave the cabins by eight, but that's fine. Uh, we'll still be able to enjoy a bit of the ship, I guess, um, and go to the buffet a couple of times. <laughs> I did also receive this. Um, I'm not entirely sure what this is, and I haven't opened it yet. Um, so I'm going to open that now. It's the check-in envelope, so I'm not sure. It's probably, now I think about it, it's probably the luggage tags and... Well, it just be the luggage tags. I can't think what else they'd give us, to be honest. Luggage tag, um, which we'll need. And some paperwork. Um, that's for additional items. Okay. Some information on what you're not allowed to bring and how to put tags on a suitcase. So they've, they seem to have taken care of everything, which I wasn't really expecting. Um, but yeah, we've got, we're all ready to go. Um, <laughs> it's a bit sad when you think about it, but there you go. So everything's, I'm going to deal with that tomorrow um, because we're not going, we've got an extra day. We've got um, tomorrow we're in Lanzarote, um, so we've got that to look forward to. We've been told the weather is rain in the morning and then sun and cloud in the afternoon. So hopefully we'll get some last minute sun in there as well. And we'll be able to explore the port um, probably in the afternoon. I think we've got to be back on uh, all aboard 4.30. So we'll be leaving at about 5 o'clock, uh, which is fine. Um, so we can do some late night, not late night. Um, early afternoon exploring of Lanzarote, which, by the way, is the most easterly of the Canary Islands. I don't know whether you knew that. You probably did. Um, <laughs> but yeah, guys, there's a lot of stuff to process, a lot of stuff to go through, um, but we'll do that tomorrow. Um, I just want to kind of enjoy the holiday as much as I can. Um, I'm, I'm stoked that we don't have to get off the ship really early. I think it was um, with other cruises you do, um, but yeah, guys, that's going to bring us to the end of day six on board the Piano Azura, uh, the Sea Day. Uh, there hasn't been much to film today, so it's probably quite a short video. I've just been basically sunbathing and walking around, so there <laughs> haven't been much to show. But um, it's been good. Um, the end of the holiday is definitely creeping up on us, um, which is one of those things. Um, you know, every, every everything has to come to an end, which is a bit of a that's a bit of a bleak note to end it on. I, want, I don't want to end it on that. I want to end it on something a bit more positive. Um, so I've just got to think of something to say now. <laughs> That's the problem. Um, it's nearly Christmas. How about that? Christmas is coming. Brilliant. All the stress that comes with that. Um, <laughs> but guys, we're going to leave it here. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for tomorrow, day seven, where we'll be exploring Lanzarote and hopefully it won't be raining. But you never know. And I tell you what, actually, the ship has settled down a little bit. I don't feel it moving as much now. Um, or either that, I've just got used to it. I'm not sure. Probably the second one, isn't it? Yeah.